that's uh, personal contacts probably necessary. Um, first of all, welcome back to another episode of my survival let's play. And uh, yeah, it's it's not looking good for me. Basically, um, uh, I've been working uh, off camera to create uh, uh, to really uh, fully optimize. Uh, my gear in terms of enchantments, and I managed that. Uh, I had the perfect gear uh, for what I wanted, and I was uh, I was very excited to uh, uh, to, uh, to show uh, uh, you the viewers. And um, uh, then I realised uh, that I hadn't named uh, the trident that I got in the last episode. Uh, you can go watch that to see how I found it, but basically I'd given that all the enchantments that I wanted to give it and stuff, uh, and I'd forgotten to name it while doing so. And so uh, it was very expensive, at 39 levels. And I mean, yeah, no, uh, 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 that's fine, uh, I can just go AFK at my spider farm, which I did. And I reached 39 levels, and I thought, you know what, I'm gonna keep going, I can use the extra experience. And the thing about uh, bombs like my spider bomb is that uh, you need to be constantly attacking spiders, and that takes hunger. So you have to check in every now and again to eat. Uh, I, I don't know, uh, uh, there might be some program out there that allows you to just um, eat uh, occasionally. Uh, but yeah, um, I forgot to check in to eat, and I starved to death. And so uh, when I checked back, I was stood here, punching the wall like this. And I thought, something's wrong. And then I realised I died of starvation, and I didn't realise until up to maybe an hour or so later. And obviously everything will have despawned by then. So yeah, it's 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 not looking good for me. I mean, on the bright side though, as you saw, I did an end rage earlier, uh, or at least off camera, uh, and I got uh, a load of shulker boxes. Oh yeah, and I've meaning to ask, um, uh, do you want to see end raids uh, on camera? Because the only two that I've done have been off camera. So please do let me know uh, if you want to see them on camera. But basically, apart from shulker boxes, as you know, you can get lots of gear from doing end raids. And so I've got a spare pair of wings, which I'm going to put on now. Uh, let's see, what else can I use? Oh, that's already got Feather Falling 4 and I'm breaking 3, I'll be taking that. Oh, I can combine that with that maybe. Taking those. I'll probably make my own helmet. Uh, Take that shovel, I think. And no, that one they probably can't combine. Yeah, I mean, it's a good start. The other good thing is, uh, I have got all of the villagers that I need to fully restore everything. Oh yeah, and another thing, uh, I realised I just, you know, casually came down here into this brand new hole that I've made. And uh, uh, I, uh, I think I'll probably cut away editing earlier so that you didn't see this, but uh, yeah, this is almost done, I just need a tiny bit more moss to finish up um, uh, this little dirt area here. Basically, uh, what I've done is I've replaced uh, all of the um, stone on the walls with deep slate, uh, all of the dirt on the walls with moss, covered the floor in moss, given it a bunch of carpets and azalea things, and yeah, I think it looks really cool. But I have to get back to trading now, uh, and I can get a good amount of levels by trading a bunch with my farmers. Uh, I'll get to doing that. Oh no! Why are you here? How did you get in here? So it might turn upstairs. Things might turn upstairs. Punching this to death. Yeah, and uh, while I remember, um, 
I've done a lot of work on uh, the base. Uh, there used to be a massive landmass here, I cleared that out, and I filled in, filled in all the walls with white concrete, so now when I move, uh, move my uh, mouse quickly, this happens, which is weird to look at, and now I've fallen in a hole. Okay, uh, most of my gear is just about up to scratch now, uh, just, there's just a couple of things that um, uh, I'd like to be a little bit better, but honestly, they aren't really necessary uh, for this video. Um, so, on the next uh, port of call, or is that the phrase? Uh, but, um, uh, last video, I asked you to come up with a name for our pink axolotl. And uh, the name that I chose out of uh, the selection of one name <laughs> uh, is Wafer. Uh, you know, like, um, you get those pink wafer things, like biscuits. I don't know, but uh, yeah, um, uh, I like it, so that's what they're called now. Be free, wafer. And uh, you can probably guess uh, from the fact that uh, I pressed F5, which means that there's going to be a surprise in my inventory, and that surprise is another axolotl. Yep, uh, while I was down AFKing in my spider farm, an axolotl actually spawned in the water stream that transports the spiders uh, to the killing chamber. So, uh, 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 breaking half the farm in the process, uh, I now have another brown axolotl. So, uh, yeah, please do come up with a name for them. Uh, and, uh, yeah, hopefully it's alright. Right then, anyway, uh, on with uh, one of the main tasks of the video. Uh, now, you may remember last episode, uh, my failed attempt at uh, mining for netherite. Uh, and uh, so you remember after that I said that off camera I'll mine up uh, a truckload of sand and make uh, a bunch of TNT and I did that uh, most of it was used for concrete for the mega build that you can see in the background but uh, I did use a fair amount of it to create over two and a half stacks of TNT now uh, my goal uh, is to get uh, around 40 pieces of ancient debris um, and hopefully that is achievable with the amount that I have. Let's go! Oh look at that! A couple of pieces just by uh, winding up the tunnel where I'm going to place the TNT. It's going off to a great start. Move. It's not very nice of you. Honestly. So people. So rude. But, uh, right. Let's, uh, set off this massive chain of TNT. Yes, there's some. Yes, there's some. And that's some more up there. Oh, and there's some more up there as well. And there's some more at the end of that tunnel there as well. Yeah, that's two pieces of, uh, gear. Another piece. Oh, there's some. Yes, ancient debris. Two bits very close to each other. Oh, but there's some there and some there. If I ever need gold or quartz, I know where to come. Oh, but there's some there. Yes, there's some. And there's some over there as well. Oh, hang on, there's some. Okay, well, I'll shot. Hopefully, I get at least one more piece of debris. And I have. Cool. Ah, one problem. I appear to be short gold. Oh, no, there's some there. It's enough for three things. It isn't great. So, I suppose, um, yeah, as I said, I know the place to go for gold and such. So, I suppose I shall go there. In a moment. I'm just going to quickly do some upgrades. And that is some netherite gear. I'm looking fancy. And that's prickle. Soft pickle. And 
what's going to be regular pickle. Nice. You know what, I'll just name it that now. Pickle. Up. Nice. Almost forgot. I need to feed. Because that got destroyed. So, I'm just going to go back and make myself a shield. I mean, business now. Look at me. All fancy my netherite and elytra with a shield. Uh, I should probably enchant this and stick a D on it. And, yeah. Also, very quickly, look at how happy they all are in their pond together. I'm going to make the Max Lotal Sanctuary soon. Just, uh, it's going to be underneath uh, my main base. Uh, as I said, I'm going to go to a completely different build style in the basement. Literally, uh, the only thing that um, uh, the main exterior for is to house uh, the sorting system, uh, storage system, uh, and just, you know, look impressive. I'm not actually going to be putting uh, very much in here because uh, I think it would kind of ruin the very open uh, feel that I want. Okay, next on the agenda, um, you might remember me saying that I'm going to be putting off uh, a certain project for a while, uh, and I've decided, you know what, no, I'm not going to. So uh, today I'm going to get started uh, on the industrial district, beginning with the witch farm, the centerpiece of it all. Now, uh, I've actually, um, I found a design, in fact, uh, most of the designs I found didn't actually require a perimeter, because you just AFK at a very high up spot um, uh, in the sky. Uh, and, uh, yeah, so you would think that that would put a stop on my plans for an industrial district, but no, I'm still going to have an industrial district. Uh, it just, um, uh, it, it won't be within uh, uh, in the uh, uh, perimeter uh, that I've dug out, or will dug out, or will have dug out, or no. What's the word for? Oh, sorry. Um, uh, how would you say uh, something that you would? Oh, would have. Uh, I'm being an idiot, aren't I? Yeah. Uh, uh, instead of going in the perimeter that I would have dug out. Um, uh, it's just going to go, you know, uh, 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 overground, going to have everything, uh, perhaps floating little in the sky. Ooh, that could look good, actually, if I have everything with, like, some decorative thrusters, maybe. Because, you know, I've got the whole futuristic thing going on over at my base. Um, so, yeah, that could work. And here we have it, the completed witch farm. Uh, it is a design by uh, Logical Geek Boy, and I'll leave uh, a link to it in the description. Uh, but basically, it is uh, very. Um, it is, it's, or at least, it's pretty cheap. Uh, it's decently fast, and these are the items that I got for it uh, um, so far. Uh, I haven't done any AFKing or anything. This has just happened in the background. So yeah, that's pretty good. Uh, I'm not sure how it's ended up in two chests or how they're two different things of glowstone. But, um, I'm sure it's fine, I'm sure it's nothing to worry about. But yeah, this is the beginnings of my uh, industrial district. Uh, now, this isn't quite in the center, as the AFK platform is just up there, to the left. Um, uh, and that's because uh, the killing chamber is actually slightly on the left of the farm. Ooh, and there's a spot I missed while spawn proofing. Uh, yeah. Uh, I've had to spawn proof this entire area under here with water. Uh, I'm not uh, uh, I, I'm not too uh, fussed that it doesn't look that pretty because this is the industrial district. I'm probably not going to decorate it that much, if at all. So yeah, now uh, that's been built and it's going to start pumping out gunpowder, I no longer have a need for this thing over here. But I mean, honestly, mm, I, I don't know if I'm going to tear it down. It was fair amount of work to build that up, and yeah, you know, I, uh, I'm going to keep it for the time being. Uh, I'll probably decorate it later uh, if I don't change my mind, but um, uh, you know, uh, 
let me know, uh, know down in the comments um, if you think I should keep this or not. I realise I'm giving you uh, a lot of decisions to make uh, this episode, uh, but yeah, hopefully, uh, hopefully you don't mind. Okay, so um, I've constructed this uh, tiny little uh, storage room uh, for all of the drops and everything. Uh, and I mean, uh, I don't know if I'm going to decorate it. As I said, uh, this place is like, um, it's an industrial district. Uh, uh, I built it specifically so that uh, uh, I could just, you know, have all my farms here. And uh, the, I, I think I'm just going to, you know, it, it just ignore decorating everything. It's, it, it's a place designed uh, for pure industrialness. Uh, uh, there, there isn't going to be anything uh, particularly um, uh, exciting about, um, you know, just general good lookingness. This is going to be ugly, it's going to be functional, uh, and it's going to be great. But yeah, as you can see, the witch farm has been doing its thing. Um, uh, not particularly long, but that's fine. Uh, and eventually, these three walls here will all be covered in chests. Uh, currently this one is, uh, but I still need to do these two. And uh, the reason I haven't done them yet is because I don't currently have enough wood. Uh, spoiler for next episode. Wink wink. Uh, my frames are dropping like crazy. I just want to get onto this AFP platform. My computer really doesn't like it. Come on. Oi, 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 oi. Yes, there we go. Picking through the roof. What's the thing on? Okay, uh, yeah, as I said, this is the little air K platform. I stand here, the witch farm is active. The roof above my head keeps phantoms from spawning, and the fact that this is glass keeps mobs from spawning here. Also, uh, this is slabs, so again, uh, uh, no mobs. And. Uh, yeah, I can just take off all my clothes, dump all of my stuff in here. I'm terribly sorry for the horrible frames. It's uh, I, I, I don't know why, but uh, my computer really doesn't like heights. <laughs> and then yeah, uh, I'm just gonna you know sit here for a little while, uh, call my witch farm to do its thing, and I will see you later. Bye!